thing. It makes a nice man to be an ordinary trade. It makes a man to be like a Miss Smith in the hands of the devil. That is why you must secure yourself in Christ Jesus. We say no more time, secure yourself in Christ Jesus. Secure yourself in Christ Jesus no more time. So that the devil will not waste your precious life. The devil will not make your precious life. He is going around looking for whom to destroy. Maybe later today we would have heard some stories of how he has destroyed some people. Don't let your life be destroyed by the devil. That is why you are passing and hearing this word this morning. And what else you are going to continue to hear this word? Maybe don't even have a mission of coming to control. But you are going to continue to come and hear that your life is precious to God. You are wonderfully and carefully made. Precious you are. Wonderful you are. Don't allow the enemy to waste you. Don't allow the enemy to waste you. Don't allow the enemy to waste you. Why don't you repent today? Confess yourself. Only repent. You might have been evil around your life. But now things can change. You might have been wicked around your life. Now things can change. Jesus can change you. He can transform you. You might have been a terror in your vicinity, in your street. You terrorize people. You are wicked. You do all sorts. For now, Jesus wants to be the Lord of your life. Why don't you surrender wicked life to him? And let him make you a good man. Let God make good out of that wickedness that you have been doing all your life. Why don't you allow Jesus to make you a good man? Don't drink the blood of you and me anymore. What are you drinking it for? Don't you know the blood of Jesus was shed for you? To wipe away all the sins you have done. Every anxiety of body that is that is against you, God wants to wipe it and give you a new start. That is why we call it born again, born anew. To be become like a newborn baby. Because all your many years of wickedness, God will not remember them anymore. That is why they call it born again. So many years of wickedness and sin will not be remembered by God anymore. Because it's a merciful God. Tender in mercy, ever loving, ever caring. Ever loving, ever caring. Precious, loving. Why don't you repent? Why don't you repent? Tomorrow, like I always say, is too dangerous. Tomorrow is too dangerous. You are hearing me because God has ordained you to hear it. God has ordained you to hear it. Let this world not waste concerning you. Let this world not waste concerning you. Prayer will be made for you now. For as many that have heard this word since the time we started, we pray that the Lord God Almighty will forgive you. I pray for as many that are sick this morning. At the mention of the name of Jesus, let every name of sickness bow down in your life. Be healed. Be delivered. Let chains and shackles of darkness be broken in your life. Let Jesus set you free by his blood today. Today, today you are healed. Today you are delivered from sin and sicknesses and diseases. Today you are delivered from sin and sicknesses and diseases. Today you are delivered from oppression of darkness. Today Jesus will save you by his mercy. He will save you by his mercy. In the name of Jesus Christ we pray.